So welcome again, we have reached exercise 3, which is to find the minimum of four re real numbers. So we need to write the function min that determines the minimum of two real numbers, and then we need to use minimum in order to find the minimum between the four numbers. So it's not very uh, difficult. So if we have four numbers, let's say 2, 7, uh, uh, 8 and minus 1 so I can calculate the minimum between these two it's equal to uh, 2 7 uh, it's equal to 2 and then calculate the minimum between 2 and 8 it's equal to 2 and then calculate the minimum between 2 and minus 1 it's equal to minus 1 or I can so I, there's a lot of possibilities so I can calculate the minimum between these two and the minimum between these two and then the minimum between these two so let's start so we have uh, the minimum of, of between real numbers so let's say we have a double so obviously the uh, the type of the function is double because we need to return one of these elements so it's called min uh, it takes uh, two doubles x and y and of course i will return the uh, minimum so you can uh, uh, option one uh, say that if x is less then y so obviously the minimum i will return x and otherwise there's no need for else here because if it's not x obviously it's y so this is a solution or you can in just one instruction say so if x is less than y question mark i will return x otherwise i will return y so you can either pick these three instructions or pick the last instruction so i'll keep this one and here we need to read four uh, values so let's call it a b c and d so print f enter four uh, four uh, values so we don't care if it's float double or integer so we need to read so the user can enter integer ones so percentage lf percentage lf percentage lf and percentage lf the first one is address of a address of b address of c and address of t and then we need to calculate the minimum so let's print f so the minimum so we can print here you say the minimum between a b c and d is equal is equal to percentage obviously it would be lf so i will print just two digits after the comma and here i can calculate the minimum so multiple possibilities so i will pick the second one so it's the minimum so first i will calculate the minimum between a and b so it will return one uh, either uh, a or d and here uh, between c and d and then i will calculate the minimum between these uh, two so let's run so I will enter 2, 7, 8, and minus 2, and minus 2. So obviously the answer is minus 2. And even if I, I place minus 2 elsewhere, so for example this, again it will be minus 2. So there is no recursive uh, version of uh, this function because there is no arrays, there is nothing, uh, there is no calculations, repeated calculations. So uh, this is the idea here. Uh, so this is it. So if you have any questions, do not hesitate to write to me. And of course, I will answer you back. And again, thanks for watching.